If you're looking to buy some coins, then go to fifutstore.com and use discount code MAX for 10% off for the cheapest, fastest, best place to buy your coins. Link below. Ready, Max. Ready, Max. Ready, Let's go, bro. Come on, let's go get him. Come on. Yeah, you're first. Come on, so you need to be Max plays versus Anishun Gibb in a boxing match. Like, how has this happened? To think it's all came from that time Gibbo stole Domino's a fat fuck. Oi! Keep it PG! So said, sorry, sorry Gibbo. But, um, yeah boys, to think it's came from that to facing Gibbo in front of 8,000 people training like athletes. It's mad. But, it's sick. Come on into the kingdom, boys. But uh, been here about six weeks. Um, I want to live on my own. You know, I know it sounds weird, but I feel I feel most productive when I'm on my own. Oi! Is that be is that beers beside you? <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a cheat. It was a cheat day yesterday, boys. It was a cheat day. <sighs> now I wanted to capture this whole experience in a documentary. Firstly. So that in 30 years time, I can look back and I can go, look, I did this. Um, but also, because, you know, JJ was paying out pretty good and like, who doesn't want to make that paper, you know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, that's a one dollar <laughs> note, bro. It was for dramatic effect. But yeah, at this point, you know, so early on, I, I realized it was going to be a tough and, and challenging, but I didn't realize to what extent. Here's a funny thing, so uh, my coach, he makes me listen to white noise or TV static in headphones. I'm not only listening to my usual sort of EDM or hip hop, uh, he's worried if I put on a bit of Martin Garrix I'll end up on the sesh, you know what I mean? <laughs> so I even got Upstairs and McGarrix turned into a home gym boys, check this out. Boys, check out the home gym. It's a bit messy. It's a little bit messy. Can't clear it up, but uh, yeah, boys, over to the back. I was actually um, I was training pretty hard last week, and uh, I actually ripped the bag off the wall. But yeah, boys, there's only one thing on my mind these days, and that's the bag. Look at the state of them. Get up! Get up! Get out of your bed! Get up! You're a disgrace! Oh, shit, coach. You're not just fight like... in three months and you're in a state like that! You're gonna get knocked out! I'm not, I'm not gonna get knocked out. I'm not gonna get knocked out. It was, it was just, it was two cheat days. What happened again? What happened again? Tonight, he is here from Northern Ireland. Let's hear it for Max Plays. Tonight for Max as he steps out into the ring. Oh, this is a good tune, isn't it? Yeah, this I like is getting this. the crowd going. If no else, he's got the best walkout music, this kid. In making this a fight. He comes straight ahead like a recognition. Motive, look at him, straight out, I'm right in the you. face. He's gone oh, right, straight okay. in. Uh, to be fair, someone did offer a glove there and he did, there you he did go. throw a punch. Credit to Max. This is not going to be wow. a, a long fight. 
one of these guys could hit the canvas. And this could be the first boxing match we've seen. Uh, Max is moving. Yeah. But he's not punching much. Much nice runs. Wow, he almost landed a punch And he there. is going in. And he's trying to land that jab. Is he going in recklessly, though? His chin's right up. Yeah, partly. No guard up there for him. Now he gets those hands back. Keep going for the this is an well. under... This is... This pace is fast and furious. He's unsustainable. Max is still there. He's taking some big shots, but he's still there. Max is trying to shot from the side just to keep. Gibbo is going in for the kill, though. And Max is now up against the ropes. He's keeping his hands up, though. Keep those hands up, Max. There is a massive weight advantage here for Annie. And now that seems to be taking its toll. Body blow. He is relentless here. Body blow, followed by a blow to the head. This is serious now for Max. He needs to fight back. He needs to give himself something oh. to hang on to. Max is very tired. But credit to him, he's got the heart of a lion here. He's taken everything Annie's got. And Annie hasn't put in the lot of craft he does. It's true. He's good for it. Yeah, maybe you should sign him on that. Wow, still landing punches out there, still just... Oh, Max is just taking a hammer, yeah. As, as we would say on the podcast, he's relentless. Credit to Max. Max is rocked there. I think we've got a standing count. He's yes, being we told have. to stay away. This is a standing count. Rightly so. He was shook after that one. Yeah, it's, it's worrying because actually Max's head guard, it needs some adjustment. It, at the it, end I mean, of if that. it fit, we would, it would help. Yeah, very good point. This is fun. This is what modern day boxing should be like. Two young guys just going at it. Wow, he is aggressive again. He's down. Gibb has floored someone for the first time tonight. Credit to Max, so Max he back was off. straight back straight up. Straight back, back. rolled out of that well one. Well done to him. Credit to him. Good, just collecting his breath in the corner here. Breathing heavily, though. He's the fans are on it. their feet. Now, the referee's working this one. Rightly right so. Now. Well done. The you want to take your fighter. Gibb goes out to the corner. He's lifted by his trainers. That is the win he was looking for tonight. Relentless, aggressive, incredible. A Nissan Gibb there. As, as anticipated, and he went out there and did his thing. Good show, Mr. Gibbs. As follows, after one minute and 30 seconds of the second round, your referee was forced to stop the contest. Your winner, by way of technical knockout, TKO, boxing out of red time, from Saudi Arabia. Let's hear it, raise the roof. So guys, hopefully you enjoyed that little uh, parody documentary I did, but it doesn't end there. I'm serious now, okay? That, that was a joke, that was all a joke. Now it's for serious talk, I might, Throw my name in the hat for another fight. Oh, by the way, apologies, my camera light battery's off, so the lighting's probably not amazing right now. But, yes, boys, I might fight again, okay? I did okay against Gibble. Yes, yes, I got beat. Yes, it was a TKO. But I did all right considering I did fuck all training. And Gibble's been training a lot longer than me. Like, I did nothing, boys. I was lazy. I was going out. I was loving life. And I wasn't training hard. And I really think if I had trained hard, I really could have possibly won that fight. So, boys... I'm going to give you a list of possible contenders. Let's just say I do decide I want to call someone out. Let's just say, I'm not doing it now, but if I do, I'm going to give you a list of contenders and let me know what you think in the comment section below which one I should fight. First up, we have Stephen Tries. That would be my favourite fight. He's about my height. He's a bit skinnier than me. It'd be nice to fight someone that's skinnier than me this time. Gibbo definitely, definitely wasn't skinnier than me. Um, so Stephen Tries, love the guy, um, but he would be my number one choice. Next up would be Chris MD. Thought he would fight me. Got a lot more subs. But you know we're pretty cool. Like you know he seems signed enough. Uh, and he did he did flirt with the idea of fighting in a recent video. Same height, similar weight. That would be a good fight. Next one is Steel Baker. He's got the height on me. Okay, he's got the height. But I've got the guns. I've got the. I have got the guns. So Steel Baker is the next one. Next up is the burnt chip. I've got the weight. He again he's got the height. This is my least favourite option. I don't really want to punch the face of Josh. He's a very good friend. I know I did with 
Gimbal, we've got a different type of relationship. Me and Gimbal piss each other off a lot of the time, so we've been close to fighting before. Me and Chippo would never really fight. And the final one is Johnny Kerry. Similar height to me, but he probably has the weight, and he looks like a bit of a gym lad. But, you know, he's not the only gym lad, boys, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, boys, they are the options. Let me know in the comment section below who should I call out. Theo Baker, Chris MD. Steven tries the burn chip or Johnny Carey. Let me know in the comment section below. Peace out, boys.